Hello and welcome to the PC Machine Tech Help Show. I'm your host, Craig Chamberlain. We are on the Faster 7 series where I show you how to speed up your Windows 7 operating system. And I hope you're feeling brave today because today's lesson might damage your data. There is an inherent risk. It's not a huge risk, but a risk does exist. Now, let's start by go ahead. Let's go ahead and start by going to your desktop and right clicking on computer and selecting properties. This is going to bring up your system properties as before, your control panel. Select the device manager to bring up your device manager. And under disk drives, click the drop down arrow and right click on your hard drive and select properties. We followed all that. Now go to the policies tab and we have two checkboxes here. Now the first checkbox is called write caching and essentially it puts your data on your computer in a holding pattern in your system memory before it writes the data to your hard drive. Now the reason your computer does this is because your computer hard drive is slower than your system memory and processor. So putting it in a holding pattern will allow it to write to the disk faster because it just constantly keeps the pipeline full of information. So we want to keep this enabled if it's already enabled and enable it if you don't have it enabled. Now enabling the service as a warning does risk that data floating around if you suddenly lose power on your computer. So there is an inherent risk of damaging your data or corrupting your data in some odd instance that your power is just randomly dropped. So if you have that as a concern if something is happening, don't enable this. As for the second one, make sure you enable this as well. It does further increase the risk of data corruption because it doesn't periodically flush it. It keeps it in that holding pattern for a longer period of time, but it does increase disk access speed a little bit more. So that's all there is to this video. Once you've checked off those two boxes, select OK. Now as a last warning, don't enable this for uh, removable devices like external hard drives and USB drives. Please don't. Because if you have that data floating around, somebody pulls out the USB drive or bumps into it and it loses its connection, you're going to corrupt some data. That's it. That's all there is to this video. So thanks for stopping by. Thumbs up if you liked it. And stay tuned. There's more Faster 7 series videos to come.